Information from Hurricane Laura and the offering the effects of Hurricane Laura, the Category 4 hurricane just overnight. Hurricane Laura slamming ashore as a monster Category 4, punishing the Louisiana and Texas coast with winds up to 150 miles an hour. But even more dangerous, especially in low lying areas, a massive storm surge that officials story are of that 14 year old girl killed overnight by a falling tree. It happened in the city of Leesville, Louisiana. That's about 100. Alright, what's good y'all man? I'm back here with another video, man. Today is not a regular video that I will be, you know, posting or whatever, man. Um, you know, as y'all know, I live in Louisiana. Um, I stay in Leesville. And you know, Hurricane Laura, that's how you pronounce it. Um, Hurricane Laura just uh hit the hit us hard, man. And it's not even just my city, you know what I'm saying? It hit Lake Charles, um, you know, plenty of cities, man, and it did a lot of damage. Um, you know what I'm saying? So uh I just want to show y'all around like the damage that it caused and everything and um it really hurts because it's like you know it's not it's not how i usually seen leesville you know what i'm saying so it's like it's very tough but man just go ahead and show them that so you know what i'm saying like this is some damage that it did um that is my next door neighbor's house and all that stuff but yeah it's it's very it's crazy, man. It's, it's it, it hurts because it's like you would never think something like that could happen. Let me go ahead and show y'all my backyard. This is how my backyard looks and everything. It's, it's crazy, man. It's it's crazy. Trees just everywhere, but I'm about to go ahead. I'm gonna go ahead and show y'all around Leesville show y'all the damage that it did man and hopefully we can come as one you know as the city and just bring it all back to life man uh stay tuned because we'll be right back all right y'all i just want to show y'all you know the damage or whatever man what it's done you know i'm gonna ride around i got the flunkies with me you know what i'm saying but man look at this bro like that's just that's just one house out of a lot like that is just one house out of a lot man there's trees everywhere man it's just trees everywhere um I ain't gonna be going everywhere in Leesville, but I will be taking y'all, you know what I'm saying? Um, I should go around the, the circle, huh? So I'm not. Oh yeah, it's a tree, it's a tree with a house like in there, man. Yeah. Hey, but some, you know, some, of, some of us really fortunate, you know? Yeah, and that's, that's the crazy thing. Um, another thing that I found out this morning a 14 year old girl passed away because a tree had landed in her house and killed her and that's sad bro because it's like that don't happen on a daily that that's not a common death look at this man look at this bro like that is just wild that is just crazy man that is sad bro like it's that's not like and we're not used to this, you know what I'm saying? We're not used to stuff like this. Like, it's just. Yeah. Look at that, man. Just trees everywhere, bro. Buku trees. The rose got everything on there, man. Look at that. Y'all, look at this, man. This is a park that's like right in front of the the elementary school. This is crazy, bro. Look at this, bro. Look at the school, bro. Trees just going on the fall, bro. It's just bad, man. That hurricane really hit us hard. Look at that. Yo, look at this, man. This is right by a church, bro. Right by a whole church. I'm about to ride by my high school. Um, I don't know if my high school got hit. I didn't get no news from it. But um, I knew there's a park by my high school. And um, I'm about to show y'all this. Look at that. 
That's a whole power line. That's wild, bro. Did y'all see that? Look up there. Look at that, bro. Man, look at that, bro. This right by the baseball field and the softball fields at, at my school. The building behind it, that's the junior high. But, man, look at this, bro. The tent's coming off, man. That's wild, bro. Look at that, bro. That's wild, bro. And this not even like, I wanna say this probably not even two, two years old, bro. They just like remodeled a lot of this stuff, man. And this is my, this is a high school parking lot, man. But, uh, man, uh, I'm about to show y'all about this park. Show y'all about this park and, um, This is crazy, bro. <laughs> That's just wild, bro. <sighs> sad. It's just sad, man. Look at that, bro. That's just crazy, bro. This is the middle school I attended, bro. This all messed up, bro. All messed up. Look at this. Hold on. It's a big old tree, man. Sad, bro. How things could change, man. 2020 has not been the year. It's just sad, bro. It's sad. It's very sad, man. But um, I'm about to go get this gas for my my mama car real quick, and um, I'll stay tuned, man. I'll be right back, man. The video won't be over. But stay tuned, real quick. Look at this, man. It's a whole tree in somebody's house, man. That's wild, bro. That's wild. I'm gonna wrap up the video like that, man. I know it's it's wild, but okay, hey, man. Right I know we all gonna come together as one big old right city right and um, you know, clean it up, Depend man. Do what we gotta do. I don't know when the electricity will be back on, but I gotta get that basketball, bro. Don't that you know what I'm saying? So. But uh, y'all stay tuned. I'm gonna go down the highway. That's probably the last thing I'll show y'all, man. But I'm gonna wrap up the video like that, man. So stay tuned. I'll be right back. Yeah, I just want to uh, say shout out to Deshaun Rivers, you know what I'm saying? He did something uh, most people wouldn't do, you know. Uh, like, he met this, like, man who was less fortunate than him. And he, like, gave him a place to stay at a hotel for the storm. And he was out early this morning chopping wood and stuff, you know, moving branches around, you know, him and his people, you know. So shout out to him. Yeah, man. And there's, like, real-life people out here, bro, like, that's been going through it. And, you know, seeing people just helping here and there, you know, just giving people places to stay. And... You know, helping moving the wood and all that stuff, man. It just that's love, man. That's love, bro. You know, I'm gonna do my part for the community as much as I can, help people out and do what I could do, man, before I go back to college and all that stuff, man. But you know, this was a devastating, devastating, devastating moment. Um, this was a devastating moment, and you know, it's just a it's, it's a very sad, sad day, you know what I'm saying. But you know, thank God for. You know, letting us get through it with no, 
know too many injuries, but you know, a lot of people lost their homes, but hopefully they can get them back, you know, easy and all that good stuff, man. But um, y'all stay tuned, man, because you know, I got videos coming on the way. I just wanted to show y'all this, you know, my city, where I'm from, and all that stuff. Uh, but stay tuned, man. I will be dropping more videos, man, my boy. You know what I'm saying? I will be dropping more videos, but uh, man, stay tuned, man. If y'all haven't liked already, man, go ahead and like this video, man. Share this video too, man. Um, subscribe, bro. Subscribe, man. We gonna be a, uh, we gonna be lit. Stay tuned. Breaking story of that 14-year-old girl killed overnight by a falling tree. It happened in the city of Leesville, Louisiana. That's about a hundred miles inland from the coast. CBS's Jonathan.